Now, let's start to learn how you can design using SolidWorks. Every part must start from a sketch. A 2D sketch is a set of lines that can be used to shape a part, or can be used as a guide. A 2D sketch must start on a plane. This plane can be created by us, or we can use one of the existing planes that our template has. To start a sketch, go to the Sketch tab and click on the Sketch tool. It begins by asking us which plane we want to use. For now, click on the front plane. SolidWorks will automatically move us to view the front plane. Now we can start our sketch. Start it by clicking on the line tool and draw a simple rectangle. Do not worry about the dimensions for now as those can be changed later. Once we have the rectangle drawn, we will need to give it a size. Click on the Smart Dimension tool at the top. Click on the line we would like to define and then drag the dimension to the side and click again to place it. Now a window pops up asking us what size we would like to make the line. Let's make it 1 inch. Now, do the same for the other line, except make it 2 inches. When working on a sketch, we need to keep in mind that the sketch must be defined in a spot and not be movable. If you click on a vertex of our rectangle, you can see that it is movable. This is because we never defined a starting point. Click and drag the vertex to the origin and release it. You will notice that the lines have now changed to black. When all lines are black, this means that the shape is defined. Now let's close this sketch and make our rectangle three-dimensional. Open the Feature tab and click on Extrude Boss slash Base. It is now asking us what we would like to extrude. Click on the sketch we just created. Now we need to say how far we want it to extrude. Let's go with three inches. When finished, click the green check mark. You can see that this feature has now been added to the feature tree on the left. And the sketch we created is contained inside of it. Save this file in a folder to use for later. Now you have learned to build a simple part. You can play around with the extrusion and sketch tools to learn the different tools available.